Welcome back, everybody. The exclusive Duquesne Club on 6th Avenue downtown is causing some controversy tonight over what is on its roof. As Pittsburgh's Action News 4 reporter Ray Petlin tells us, the plan to make their own honey has put the club in a sticky situation. Urban agriculture has become kind of popular around Pittsburgh, with rooftop gardens starting to pop up on many buildings downtown. However, apiaries or beehives are becoming popular too, and one beehive is causing quite a buzz. Well, the issue is you have to get a variance before you put these beehives up. They put the beehives up first, so we're working with them to try to resolve the issue. And that's where the beehives atop the exclusive Duquesne Club are coming into question. We're told they moved the hives to the top of their 6th Street building to see if they would work, and they did. So the Duquesne Club had a public celebration for the first harvest of Hive 325, as they call it, earlier this month without zoning approval. It was a public launch of this, uh, of this beehive situation, so I think that's how the word got out. A Duquesne Club spokesperson told us they're working to get that variance, and the city told us they're willing to work with the club to make sure everything gets squared away. Are they going to have to move these hives? I don't think so. If they go to their zoning department and get the right approvals, everything should be fine. The city totally embraces this kind of thing, whether it's beehives downtown or goats on the side of hillsides helping us clean up weeds, that kind of thing. Uh, we just have to follow the rules when we do it. Steve Rapaski, president of Berg Bees, tells us the bees don't pose a threat to anyone and honeybees are vital to Pittsburgh area agriculture. Ray Petlin, Pittsburgh's Action News 4.